two, three. Hello, my name is Reed Redden and I'm an extension specialist. This is Jake Thorne, extension associate. Uh, we're here today to talk to you about a brand new product on the market uh, beginning this year in 2019 uh, to help sheep and goat producers fight the fight against internal parasites. And so um, internal parasites is one of the major issues, if not the major issue for many sheep and goat producers in the state of Texas. And so we're excited about a new product and excited to kind of share some more information with you about it. Um, not only is this a new product, it has a revolutionary or a completely different mode of action, the way it works. And so to explain that, I'm going to use this little life cycle of a roundworm. So typically what we had done to treat animals who were you know, heavily parasitized, we would give them a drench, a dewormer, an anthelmintic, whatever you want to call it, to the animal itself. And that product would go into the animal and kill the adult worms that are living in the abomasum or the small intestine, somewhere through the digestive tract, um, and rid them of those parasites. But we didn't do anything to treat the parasites that were out on the pasture. So it's kind of go through the life cycle. An adult worm feeds on blood, or hymonchus feeds on blood, and one adult worm may, may shed thousands, if not ten thousands, of eggs per day. All those eggs are going to go through the digestive tract into a fecal pellet. They're going to be out there on pasture when conditions are right. It's the right temperature. There's the right amount of moisture. Um, those larvae are going to hatch and then come out of that fecal pellet, get on the grass. As the grass grows up, the sheep and goats are going to eat it and then reinfect themselves. This cycle takes about 21 days, but the parasite itself may live three to six months out on the pasture. Uh, depending on the time of year, uh, rainfall, temperature, so on and so forth. And the adult worm may live in the, in the animal for months, if not years. So if we're dealing with some parasites that are resistant to a dewormer, they can continually be shedding eggs and we've got a lot of eggs out on the pasture. So this new product works out on the pasture. So the product is a nematode trapping fungus. It is called Duddingtonia flagrans. That's the name of the fungus. Uh, but it's going to be marketed under the trade name Bioworma. I do encourage you to uh, go to this website, uh, www.wormboss.com.au. There is great information about not only the, the life cycle of roundworms, but treatment plans, smart drenching, so on and so forth. So a great resource from our friends in Australia on managing parasites. I encourage you to go there. So back to the product itself. So it's going to be marketed as the trade name Bioworma, as I mentioned before. The company International Animal Health Products um, owns this uh, trade name and the rights to use this product. And this itself, Bioworma, is a heavily concentrated version of the Live em All with Bioworma. This product is made to be sold to uh, veterinarians, feed mills uh, that are going to mix this into a feed that you would buy. Uh, instead of the feed being medicated, it's uh, got bioworma in it to help control internal parasites. Livamol with bioworma is a product that's intended to be purchased and used directly by uh, sheep and goat producers. Uh, Live em All is a protein, energy, vitamin supplement, and it's used as a carrier. So there's a much lower concentration. The dosage rate for this is 1.6 ounces per animal that uh, weighs in the neighborhood of 100 pounds, whereas this is 0.1 ounces, so a very, very small fraction. Uh, so it's heavily concentrated with Duddingtonia flagrans. Both of these products must be mixed into a feed and fed daily okay so jake is going to walk us through kind of an example of how uh we're looking at using this product trying to keep it simple for you so jake right as reed talked about uh, this live them all with bioworm and we're going to feed it at about 1.6 ounces per 100 pound animal per day another way to think of it is a tenth of a pound per animal uh, per day uh, so conveniently they provide a, a scoop in each bucket and we went ahead and weighed this out ahead of time and this scoop is exactly one half of a pound uh, Livamol Phyloworma which is enough to treat five animals uh, per day. Uh, so just to help you visualize this I've got uh, nine pounds of grain here and if we're supplementing animals out on pasture we could add two scoops of Livamol with Phyloworma to this grain mix it up really well and at that 10% concentration rate, uh, we can feed this, this supplement, this uh, complete mixed supplement, at one pound per animal per day. 
Um, another, another good thing about this 10% concentration is uh, if we have 200 pound animals, we can feed it at two pounds per animal. Uh, or if we're feeding lambs and kids, 50 pounders, uh, we can feed it at a half a pound, uh, which is really an a, appropriate supplementation rate uh, for animals that are out on pasture. So one thing to keep in mind, as, as Reed talked about, uh, this needs to be fed every single day. Uh, so let's think about this. Uh, at 1,000 eggs per gram, which is our typical drenching or treatment threshold, um, and an animal is, is defecating one kilo per day, they're putting out one million homocus eggs out on that pasture every single day. So it's important that we feed this every day to make sure that there's enough fungus in that feces to trap those one million potential larvae that could be damaging to the animal. All right, so what is the, the cost that's going to be associated with these products and how do we think about using this appropriately? Right, so, so Bioworma and Live em All with Bioworma are not necessarily cheap. Uh, they're going to be too expensive probably to feed year-round to make economic sense. Live em All with Bioworma is going to cost about 50 cents per animal per day. And so we're going to concentrate or the, we suggest concentrating the feeding of this around the time when parasite activity is really high those animals are shedding more more uh, eggs than normal and that's usually associated with kidding and lambing time so there's a 30 40 day window there when you could be feeding this now it's going to cost twenty dollars about twenty dollars a month to, to feed this but hopefully especially at that time when they've got lambs by their side um, there's going to be enough performance benefits those lambs and kids are going to grow uh, a little bit better and pay you back on the back end of that and, and make up the cost of this uh, uh, to, to help cover that Definitely, and especially if we have places or farms or ranches that are experiencing issues with parasite resistance where your dewormers aren't really working, if we add this in after a deworming, we can really try to capture a lot of those parasite eggs that are coming from those uh, resistant animals. So you need to be strategic about how we're going to use this, uh, but it's going to be a great tool for the people that, that really have to fight parasites uh, day in and day out. So. Uh, if you want to, to get more information about um, Bioworma or live them all with Bioworma, I encourage you to go to their website, bioworma.com. If you want an independent source, uh, you can go to wormx.info, another great place to get information about managing internal parasites. And um, if you want to order this product as a sheep or goat producer yourself, uh, you can do that through premieronesupplies.com. To our knowledge, they're the only uh, carrier that is distributing that direct to sheep and goat producers um, as of now there may be more coming but to our knowledge that's the only place uh, that you can get live them all with bioworma if you want to use bioworma yourself you need to talk to your veterinarian talk to your feed mill have them order it mix it into your feed so with that uh, best of luck managing parasites in the spring of 2019 we'll see you next time